Do you want to make money with your blogs and websites then stand by for an important announcement. Hey guys, it's your old pal Hugh from Web Dimensions coming at you today with a really cool update on ICC Keyworks. And uh, if you have this software, great. If not, I'm going to be running a special on it, so check the links in this video. Okay, so this software allows you to create websites from keywords. And if you'll check out the website here, I've got the pointer to this website. We're going to this test site here. You can see there's nothing there. I got a kind of a um, newfangled type of theme on this website that's uh, trending stories, editors, picks, and all those different kind of cool things. And obviously there's nothing there now. So let's go ahead and I'm going to show you how I can quickly create a website and also the new update for those of you who already are using this so let's just think of some video marketing terms like I'm going to go YouTube, Vimeo, Affiliate Marketing, uh, Launch Jacking, Ranking Videos, Getting Subscribers, and I think those things call for some topic headers, so let's say... Uh, sharing sites uh, video marketing techniques so I can sort of move this up here and then make these a subcategory and then I can move the techniques up here and make all these subcategories as well And I'm going to save that. Okay, so now I also think I'm going to grab one of my pre-existing parts here, which is my About Us segment. And I'm just going to add that to the project. And these already have content. As you can see, my privacy policy so on and so forth. These up here do not have content. I can add the content by clicking the C icon and this opens up with the keyword and I can grab some video content if I want to. It's automatically going to search YouTube videos and I could grab one and put it in and then write some content but in this case what I'm going to display here is this new automated content creation that I've just added. What will happen is that every uh, item that does not have content is going to have some kind of dummy content created for it, but it's pretty spectacular. So let me show you that and I'm going to go ahead and change this to a page and a video. These are going to be category plus and plus means that I want content to be created. These I'm going to leave the same. I may point this to uh, video sharing sites so there will be a link from this one page to this category page here and then there will be this content underneath there so let's go ahead and save that. And I'm going to just save project settings just to be safe. And once again, here is the lovely test website that I have set up to test my theories. And then I'm going to go ahead and click Create Categories and Menus and uh, import the keywords into the profile so that ICC Express can use them to get curated content basically forever. Now let's go ahead and execute this. Okay, it shouldn't take too long. And it seems to have done the job here, so let's take a look. And just refresh this, and let's see what we got. 
Okay, great. We've got a full website now, full of content. The menu did not get in the right place, so that's just a very basic theme. It'll work in on some of these more advanced themes. Go to the WordPress and go to appearance and menus. And you see the menu here was created, but it, it, because of there's so many different slots for the menu, it somehow it wasn't able to actually locate the primary menu slot. So we just change that and then we go back and refresh and you'll see that the menus are now nicely siloed. So you've got all these nice siloed links throughout your website. You've got actually I've <laughs> made some content on this page and it puts in the Laura Ipsum for you with the keyword and so you can come in and basically change this out switch out the image there's already a video chosen if you want to use this video you can just keep it because it's already created a thumbnail a featured image and by the way that's done with another plugin that I recommend which is called video thumbnails right here so if you go back to the main site, you'll see all these thumbnails all over were created because the Silo Factory basically picked a random video of the keyword for each post that of the for each entry in my little silo uh, design that I created here while you watched me. As you can see, all of these now have some content. It's lore mips some content, but it mentions the keyword. I've actually seen people rank websites with just the keyword and lore mips some on it. I'm not saying you should do that, but oddly enough, it's been done before. I do recommend that you come in and edit this to make it worthwhile, but you've got a very nice format already set up for you, so it makes it really fast. Everything on here. It's got some content. Now you see this, these are uh, category pages. So if there are gonna be any other posts in this category, they're gonna be listed out on this page and you just click the link to go to the post there. And I'll probably update again to, to find a random royalty free image related to the keyword rather than just the same one every time, but it still gives you something to work with here because you, you know you can go edit this with you know with WordPress or you can use ICC Express I'll just show you really quickly that as well I'm able to access all of the those posts and there they all are as well as all the pages on that website so I can for example, if I want to do uh, open this one of affiliate marketing, what I can actually do is like quickly delete this image and then just click this button to find myself. Some image relating to the keyword. So I'll just pick one of these here. And so now I can just upload that to my blog as well can add an attribution permanently onto the image if I want to uh, but I don't need to do that for the Pixabay images so I'm just going to go ahead and upload this to my blog real quick and you can see these are all the images that were created by the video thumbnails plugin and now I can just put that in And my post now has that image and I can even change the properties of the image with this little control panel right here. There you go. And then I can just basically republish it. And then we can look at that post again. We've got this video and then we've got our own image here 
And as well, I could have edited the text. So there you go. You see how easy it is to really set up almost a finished blog now with ICC keywords. All you need to do is open those posts and put your own stuff in there and you're all set. See you out. I'll see you next.